if possible. <laughs> and as the reunited de Twinkle Cakeses drifted away to that magical place, the rain stopped falling and the storm clouds disappeared and the moon rose peacefully in the evening sky, humming the jazzy melody on its silvery breath. <coughs> it was going to be a beautiful night. But Alan Taylor isn't here to see it, remembered Polly all of a sudden. And though the battle was won, her heart was filled with sorrow. Ashes to ashes, <coughs> so funny. Crumbs to crumbs. <laughs> the heroes stood beneath the starry sky of the old meadow yonder, down by the Lamonic River where the water rushes grown. They were burying their good friend, Alan Taylor. Well, actually, they were burying a small drawing of him done by Polly, especially for the occasion. <laughs> it was all they had to remember him by. Gently Friday laid the drawing in a hole in the ground, and together Jake and Barcelona Jim covered it with earth. Tis a sad night, said old Granny, who had come down to the meadow when she heard the news. And it is a sad, sad night, she said again, weeping into her handkerchief and having a crafty sip of sherry at the same time. <laughs> <laughs> Very true, said Friday, gazing off into the distance. But life is life, and death is death, and Alan Taylor will never be forgotten. The truth is a never my ring! As he sometimes liked to yell. <laughs> he was the best biscuit I ever knew. For a start, he was the only one who could talk and run around. I, a little toy bicycle. <laughs> oh, he done taught me so much about the natural world. <laughs> Sniffled Polly. He knew all about the names of all the creatures, no matter how great, nor snail. <laughs> and though he himself was small, he was a true giant among them. Nodded Friday. And I knew I hereby awarded the highest title possible, the title of Captain Excellent. Thank you, Captain Excellent. Excellent, wherever you are. Yes! Thank you, Captain Excellent, echoed the others, and for a long while everyone sat there in silence remembering their friend. But come, said the spirit of the rainbow at last, as dawn was breaking over the horizon. Today is a new day, and just as the sun rises, so too would you delicious loaves of bread. Let us feast together. Wearily, the others followed the lad over to the windmill. They watched unenthusiastically as he started up the machinery. No one really felt like breakfast, but presently an early morning breeze caught the windmill sails, and soon enough, a fresh loaf of bread appeared on the conveyor belt. The first loaf of bread the windmill had made since Nicholas the Twinkle Cakes' his time. Only it wasn't a loaf of bread at all. It was a different kind of baked good altogether. In fact, <gasps> Pizza gingerbread man, <laughs> said old Granny. With electric muscles, cried Polly. Could it be? wondered Mrs. Lovely. Well, said Jake. The truth is a lemon meringue, shouted Friday. It's Captain Excellent. Otherwise known as Alan Taylor, laughed Polly in delight. He's been baked again. Alan Taylor, Alan Taylor, you're back at number one on the not being dead chart. And that is an official Polly fact. Spirit of the Rainbow, how did you know? But the spirit of the rainbow had gone, and where he stood, there were only a couple of fruit chews glistening sweetly <laughs> among the dewdrops. <laughs> Laughed Alan Taylor, jumping up to kiss Polly on the nose. It is me! What an adventure, Polly! What strange things I saw while I was dead! They only added to my knowledge of the natural world, and perhaps one day I will teach you all about them! <laughs> and who knows, perhaps one day you will, but until then, there will be plenty more tales to tell about Polly and her friends. You see, stories are like rivers, they keep on flowing, and they sometimes have fish in them. And just as sure as the river flows, there will always be another adventure rolling around the bend. For as old Granny said that fine summer's morn as everyone sat laughing in the sunshine, the past has a way of repeating itself. The past has a way of repeating itself. The past has a way of repeating itself. But the future? Well, that's another story. Yeah.
day. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks.